accompanied the Queen everywhere, to the state visits and the horse riding and on the plane and everywhere. So, and, and the corgis are so adaptable. They just, as you can see, they are, they, they are just, and they also they are very loving dogs. So, for me, he's a fantastic companion. After the sad death of the Queen, they gained enormous popularity. Before, they were almost, they were on the list of vulnerable uh, native breeds, up until the Queen died, sadly, and their popularity started So, it's, it's, it's sad, but now, whereas previously I was asked, oh, what kind of dog is it? Is it a fox? Is it a dog? Is it a mix? Is it a, is it a German Shepherd mixed with something? Now, immediately, instantaneous, I'm talking, oh, this is the Queen's dog. I know, I know, incredible. This will be our annual event, um, and we're celebrating the Queen's life throughout the country, in Balmoral, in other royal estates, um, and in Windsor, of course, um, and 15 other estates, which I don't remember all of them. <laughs> I will be eternally grateful to the Queen for popularising such a fantastic breed. I, I don't think I'd know much about them had it not been for her. <laughs> Ha ha ha!